Excuse me, mind if I ask you a question? What would you say if we told you we could build a state-of-the-art biotech facility in just 16 months? What would you say if we told you we just built one for producing food additives? Want to see? Come on, we'll show you. The traditional way to build a processing plant is one track. First you construct the building, then you assemble the equipment inside it. But by constructing the plant and assembling the equipment on two separate but parallel tracks, delivery time is cut in half. Which of course also means your products reach market a lot sooner. This dual track approach was recently taken by GIA for Christian Hansen. We were the sole supplier for the processing plant you see here, the world's biggest and most modern facility for the production of bacteria cultures used in making cheese, yogurt and other dairy products. Christian Hansen is the world's leading producer of these cultures and this facility alone will produce several tons a day. In the past, building a plant this big and complex would take two to three years, but we did it in just 16 months. Here's how. On track one in northern Germany, work begins on the processing modules. Fermentation tanks and other key units are assembled and tested. There are more than 70 different main modules in the plant, so work has to proceed fast. Track two on the outskirts of Copenhagen. Work begins on an extension to Christian Hansen's main production facility in Denmark. It will soon be home to the units being assembled in Germany. After just eight months, the two tracks begin to merge. The assembled and pre-tested processing units are trucked north to Denmark. Where they are installed, connected, tested again on site and commissioned. The product is on its way to market just 16 months after Christian Hansen gave us the go-ahead. Now you see why our dual-track approach is also called fast-track, don't you? Here's the secret. The reason it's possible to build a plant this quickly is because the entire facility has already been built on computer. Thanks to advanced technology and GIA's unmatched experience in hygienic engineering, every process has been designed in advance. Every square inch of the plant has been mapped out. Every module has been sighted. Every valve activated. Every flow simulated. And it's all done in such detail that the transition from the virtual to the real world is virtually seamless. Because the plant's infrastructure can be designed, planned and installed in advance, the modules can be literally dropped or rolled in. From start to finish, the fast track approach usually only takes about 16 months. Longer or shorter, of course, depending on the size of the individual plant and the process involved. But generally, about half the time it used to take. Convinced? We hoped you'd be.